C88. Hello everyone and welcome back to Portal 2. My name is Otis88. And today we are finally getting out of this chamber. Last episode I unfortunately got stuck here and I spent way too much time uh, trying to figure out this chamber here. <laughs> and uh, we are now working with GLaDOS to actually try and destroy Wheatley and uh, she has uh, she has promised us that she will let us free if we manage to give her back the power of, of uh, picture science so uh, one of the clues that we have found is that uh, GLaDOS is actually um, Caroline, which was the assistant slash couple of. Okay, so it's not the most watertight plan to go confront an omnipotent power mad AI with. Still, it's a better plan than exploding, marginally. Yeah. Um, Gladys is actually Caroline, which is the uh, previous wife of Cave Johnson. Well, I don't know if wife, but at least her partner. Um, his partner. Yeah, his partner. And she was his assistant as well. And um, we might have found a clue with some paradoxes that we can throw at Wheatley. And hopefully, since he's such a moron, he will fry his circuits thinking about them. So, yeah, apparently we are done with the, with the uh, past... Uh, test chambers and now I don't know what will happen I mean we're back to today's time the itch Okay. For God's sake, your boxes with legs. It's it's literally your only purpose. Walking onto buttons. How can you not do the one thing you designed for? Try to get us down there. I'll hit him with a paradox. Warmer. Warmer. Boiling hot. Boy, okay, colder, colder, ice cold, you're arctic now. It's, you're, you're very cold. Very, very, very cold. Look, just get on the button! What is he doing, man? Oh, that's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny, because we've been in this for 12 hours, and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour! Solve it! <laughs> okay. Or those Frankenstein like creatures. Guys. Oh my god. Ah, yes! I knew you'd solve it. Hey, moron. Oh. Hello? Alright, paradox time. This sentence is false. Don't think about it. Don't think um, about it. Don't true. think about it. Don't think about it. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have heard that one before though. Sort of cheating. It's False. I'll go false. <laughs> Explosion imminent. 
Evacuate the Hold facility on. immediately. I thought I'd fix that. Warning. Reactor core is at critical. There. Fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously. Um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. Okay, so now he's testing with us. And he's exploding the place. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time. Or I get this this itch, you know? It must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I just, that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. So, you're going to test, and I'm going to watch. And everything is going to be just. Morning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown imminent. I think we're in trouble. Oh, why would you say that? I don't see anything wrong here. <laughs> Design this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Extremely dangerous. Eventually. It's uh, not at the moment, but we, I'm working on it. Still working on it. I mean, I think this is like the straightest forward test in the world. Impossible. Oh, yes. Oh, well done. Oh, that's tremendous. Is he just. He just, you know, did something. Yeah, you're not done yet, are you? Like Still got to get through the door. Need to get through the door there. Sexual. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? Same one. And I can just like watch you solve it. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Okay. Here we go. Now, do it again. And... Nothing. All right, can't blame me for trying. Okay, new tests. New tests. Got to be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. This GLaDOS is still burning someone. <laughs> Good thing it's not me anymore. It shouldn't be hard to stay alive long enough to find him. It's alright! Everything's good, I just invented some more tests. Not entirely, not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's brand new. Okay, pretty steep forward still. No! Ah, uh, I messed up. Okay, float again. I tried to run before I had to. Okay, there we go. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> well done. Seriously, both of you. Why don't, I, why don't you two go on ahead, yeah? I'll just, I'll catch up with you. <laughs> okay, so the bad news is the tests are my tests now, so they can kill us. The good news is, well, none so far, to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. Well, that's encouraging. First, why can't you? Yeah, made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Absolute dynamite. No, I'm dead. Okay, this one's actually difficult. I don't know how to time it properly. Because I think I need uh, the bridge to catch me. Out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Absolute dynamite. Too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, alright? You just do. Ah! That's why I can't help you solve the test. Uh, oh. Uh, uh. Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. Oh, that's. Oh. That's uh, interesting to say the least. Not me. Ah. Okay. No. No what? No. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no. You pressed the button. <laughs> oh my god. I really love Glados. Whitley Laboratories. I thought of some good news. He's going to run out of test chambers eventually. I never stockpiled them. Okay. I'm coming, coming, don't start yet, don't start yet. You are not going to believe this. I found a sealed off wing. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there. Filled with skeletons. Shut them out. Good as new. Skeletons. Right. I guess I did stockpile some tests. <laughs> just as mementos, though. And there we go. To be honest, you can't even tell, can you? Seamless. Seamless, yeah. Sure.
I guess this is the way. Um, still not sure how am I going to get. Oh, okay. Now I get it. So, how do we. I'm sorry, little one. But how do we get the bridge here? Just not right down there. Oh. I don't see, I don't see the answer here. Isn't that difficult? Now that I see it. <laughs> God. Getting resistant to it? Oh no, it's happening sooner than I expected. I'm sure we'll be fine. No, no, I don't think it will be fine. He's obviously not getting uh, off as much. <laughs> oh, that sounds so gross. It's probably nothing. Keep testing while I look for a way out. Okay. Alright, so that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's, well, let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted Fatty. Fatty Fatty, no parents. What? 
What's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And you also, nothing. But <laughs> some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron! Just do the test. Just do the test. Oh my god. <laughs> He's just trying to insult us. That's when you start appreciating Gladys, actually. <laughs> Her humor is more refined, uh, you know, all that stuff. Um, but yeah, I guess uh, this is a good point for us to leave it. Um, yeah, I, I will try and solve this uh, this test chamber in the next episode. So guys, I really hope you are enjoying. And if you are, please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing to my channel. And I'll see you in the next one. See ya.